in America, I heard the story how one man was sitting in his car and a devotee came up to him on the parking lot and knocked on his window and wanted to give him a book of Srila Prabhupada. The man was not interested, so he just ignored that distributor and he waved, go away, go away. He made this sign. The devotee was persistent. He kept on knocking on the window. He made that sign. Please open the, the window. I want to talk to you. But the man just said, go away, go away, leave me alone. So the devotee was a little puzzled. He was intrigued. He thought, what is this? Why is this man reacting in such a hostile way? So the Lord in the heart inspired him and he took a small book and he simply put it on the windshield wiper and he walked away. Little did he know that that man in his car was trying to commit suicide. He had the engine running and he had a pipe from the exhaust muffler going into the window and he was trying to kill himself with the carbon monoxide. While sitting there, the engine running, he was looking at that book of Srila Prabhupada. After a while, he got bored with his plan and he started thinking, well, since I'm anyway going to kill myself, what does it matter? Let me see what stupid thing this boy has put here on my car. So he opened the window, grabbed the book, closed the window and started reading. And he was reading and reading. And after a while, he stopped the engine. And after a while, he opened the window. And after a while, he got out of the car and looked for the devotee. Because he realized that it's not me who is crazy. It's the whole world out there who is crazy. So he read the book and it changed his life. 